This way! We need to cut it off before it makes it to Balahu! Do you think you can? Of course. We stopped this fire once before and we can do it again. Let Henry and I know if you need anything and we'll be right on it. Thank you, Toby, but that won't be necessary. Right. We'll have this fire out in no time. Ready, Flynn? Ready, Val. Now! That's it, Val. Well done, Flynn. Don't forget about old Harold up here, eh? <laughs> They're doing it, Henry! They're doing it! Balahu is saved! Whoa! Oh no! Fall back! Fall back! Our position has been overrun! Everyone, quickly! Now what? Uh, well, we... we can't give up. <sighs> yes, we have to keep on fighting. We'll head to the sidings just outside the town. You two should get some coaches and help evacuate. Just in case. Right. We'll see you when this is all over. They must be running low on water by now. I don't think they're going to be able to stop the fire by themselves. Henry, you need to go and find help. What? Me? Uh, but I... If I try and go for help, it'll be too late. You're much faster than me, Henry. I'll help evacuate the town in the meantime. You can do it, Henry! Balahu is counting on you! Everyone on board! We've got to evacuate right away! Oh, I hope Henry finds help soon. Oh, help. Help. I've got to find help, but where? Oh, I have no idea what I'm doing. Henry, what are you doing on our line? Oh, Thomas, I need your help. There's a fire heading towards Balahu, and Flynn and Belle are low on water, and, and I, I don't know what to do. <gasps> well, firefighters once used the water in mine and Thomas's tanks to put out a workman's hut that was on fire. Oh, yes, and there was also that time when an old farm shed was on fire. There are lots of engines with whole tenders full of water at Vickerstown. We were just there. Right. Me and Percy will go and help Flynn and Belle. And you, Henry, should go to Vickerstown and get the big engines to come and help too. There will be more than enough water to fight the fire then. Uh, okay. <laughs> And of course, you know what happened next. <laughs> he ran out of water. <laughs> I had to push him and pull the train all the way to Preston. <laughs> it wasn't my fault. My tender must have been leaking. 
Are you sure it wasn't just because you were trying to show off in front of flying Scotsman? <laughs> huh? Henry, what are you doing? There's a fire threatening to destroy Balahoo. Harold, Bell, and Flynn are doing their best to stop it, but they're running low on water. I need you all to come with me right away so they can use the water in your tenders. Not to worry, Henry. We've all just filled up and I've even got two tenders to use. We're almost there. Just a little bit further. Ah! Ow! Henry, what are you doing? The line! It's blocked by fire! D -d -d Don't worry, Henry! We can make it through! Just move as fast as you can! What? But no! I, I can't! You'll have to go without me! Henry, look at yourself! There's only one track, and you are in front! Then, uh, then we must go back! It's okay, Henry! We'll be right behind you! All the way! For the wishing tree. Well done, Henry! You did it! Now let's save Balahoo. I'm almost out of water. Oh no, not you too. Flynn, I don't think we can win this one. We have to keep trying. But Thomas and Percy are almost out of water. We have to go now or we'll be trapped. Not to worry, we're here to help. We've brought plenty of water! Oh, thank goodness. Let's get your tenders hooked up to our water pumps then. I knew we'd do it! Of course, I never lost faith. Well, that wasn't the cleanest job I've ever done, but certainly the most rewarding. Indeed! Although I can't wait to get a wash down. Unbelievable. Now it rains? Well, now. I guess I. I guess I won't need that wash down after all. <laughs> well done, all of you. Together you saved Balahu. The townspeople are very thankful. Aw, oh, it was nothing. All in a good day's work. Henry, are you okay? Oh, I'm fine, Toby. I'm glad we stopped the fire, but... I wish we could have saved more of the trees. It's okay, Henry. They'll grow back. Just you wait and see. Hello, Toby. I've brought some new saplings to plant. Ah, excellent. We need some more further down the line. Thanks for all your help, Toby. The forest will be back to its old self in no time. Indeed it will. And look, there's even going to be a new wishing tree. A fine show fighting that fire, brother. You too, Spencer. Think nothing of it. However, I do have a... pressing concern. Oh? Speak now, Scotsman! I fear that the increased mishaps with these 
troublesome trucks, as you call them, could be linked to something rather sinister. From what I've seen, accidents have been occurring at an alarming regularity. <clears throat> it's not too out of the ordinary, to be honest. What do you suggest? Engines far and wide have worked together to get to the bottom of things in the past. Um, a league, if you will. And with that being said, I think that... Lang Scotsman, your special train is ready. Your passengers are very excited to see you. Hmm, I guess my proposal will have to wait just a little longer. Duty calls. Well, I'll talk to you chaps later. Farewell. What? Come back! You haven't finished your proposal. Oh, brother. I guess there's more than one way to beat the heat, eh, Toby? <laughs> I suppose so. <coughs> I don't understand! How is there so much fire so fast? <coughs> it's because everything is so dry from the lack of rain, so it burns more easily. <coughs> <coughs> 